I remember seeing an interview with David Barry where he said he tried to write the words for my way for a publisher and they turned down his lyric so he wrote Life on Mars. That you know, that tells you everything about like where he lived. You can hear the Anthony Newley, you can hear the what, what kind of fool am I kind of in so many of his early songs. I love those songs from Punky Dory. The attractions and I really decoded uh, Low and Heroes. It doesn't sound like we were that they, they had much impact on us, but as much as um, ABBA influenced um, Armed Forces, so did those records. Of course, you know the beauty of uh, Black Star, the beauty of the the musical artistic life statement of making that record in the place that he was when he apparently where he was when you know we now know was just the measure of like the huge kind of spirit of it i love that record so much and play it all the time and uh, i know that a friend of mine who knew him quite well said he he had, he had thought about doing shipbuilding that's one of the records that i wish that he had actually got to the mic on because I, I, I think we all would have loved to i mean i think of robert wyatt's version as the real version and mine the cover if David had sung it, it would have been magnificent. I know he would have sung it beautifully and could have done that, you know. So that's the dream in my head, but I have to be satisfied with the records he did make, all of them, you know, just a, an incredible, just lucky. And I, we only met, uh, I think we only met the one time and he was very splendid company and uh, at a, uh, was that some sort of I don't know, award thing or something sitting at his table and he was just great. So, you know, I feel I have that fond memory of that. Mm -hmm.